Hi, another arena, so another report from it. This time we were not lucky, quite. I looked at my opponents and a three-letter slogan starting with W and ending with F appeared above my head. And it's worth adding that I was literally a few points short of reaching the rank of Lord. Fifth or sixth place in the ranking will result in a drop in points. Fourth place saves the situation, and anything above causes me to advance. It's time to start the nightmare called Equal Lineups. The general idea, after assessing the real chances of winning big, was the same as always. One person from my team guards the clan castle, I act as the spirit, and the rest of the team tries to recapture what the opponent takes from us. I'm not saying it was a wise plan, but against such forces it was the best we could do. I was counting on taking over the altars quickly, but we weren't very good at it. I sent all my troops to the altars, and I saw that I was not the only one doing it. And yet I saw some resistance in the altars, as if they did not want to give themselves to us. Just a bit of pessimism after seeing who we had to fight against. And now the fun begins. They broke through the defense and are occupying our castle. Quick mobilization. And I'm going with a counterattack because time is against us. I lied. It had little to do with quick mobilization. Only two people responded to my urgent call. The rest, I don't know what they did. I'd rather not know even now. The takeover of this mercenary camp was purely opportunistic. It won't be useful to us since we can't even keep our clan castle under control, but by taking it over we block others from capturing it in a short time. A moment later, I got hit in the back of the head. I'm securing the future here, and the present is laughing in my face. I was waiting on tinderhooks for the end of the occupation of the camp so that I could calmly withdraw and launch a counterattack on our castle. By this time, the number of counter-offensive raids had obscured my vision. Zero, no, hopes of staying at least in fourth place disappeared like the wind. Too much for one person, definitely too much. Here we go again. The defense was not made for spears, but for cavalry, because it was they who were supposed to defend the castle, and they finally broke through my defense. But they probably knew this would happen, because support arrived immediately. It's a pity I didn't get raid support at the same speed. Someone give me a hug. The whole plan fell apart a long time ago, but looking at the points, we are holding up really well for such tough battles. This is probably due to the selection in strongholds. On the one hand, post-trading increases the number of points gained every minute. On the other hand, it reduces the number of troops in attack or defense. In this case, it wasn't a bad idea, but if we had two more defensive camps, we wouldn't have to struggle so much with defense. At that moment I knew, I was being promoted to Lord. I deserved it. Where does this certainty come from? The difference in points between House Targaryen and House Stark was too large to make up for in a conventional way, and we also managed to defend against the last attacks of Houses Greyjoy and Tyrell. There was too little time left for them to take over our clan castle, so third place was already certain. What a match it was. I haven't sweated so much in a long time. Thank you for today, and I invite you to the after party. This match definitely didn't go my way. I was tired, I was sweating, I was throwing diamonds down the drain as if I could get hundreds of thousands of them a day. And that's only for third place. The plan was good in theory, but it had no right to work against such strong opponents. A nod to them, my family's faction, to be honest, didn't do well. I will welcome the next arena as a lord, and I feel that it will be much more difficult there. But I can't give up as long as I have the last breath of hope. The arena is a really great diversion, but personally, I would prefer five-person teams facing each other rather than counting on random players. You can find great support, but you can also hit a puddle with your sock. Very unpleasant, 
I'm not a top player. I need more time for this or a huge amount of black diamonds. I prefer the former. Maybe next year I will walk like a cutter through dry branches. I have a plan to develop my account, but I will talk about this on another occasion. Thank you for today and have a nice weekend.